if you are writing gate bt 2025 exam then this video is for you because a lot of students have doubt sir you have taught engineering mathematics course which is common to all branch but my branch is biotechnology so how will i know which chapters i have to study which chapters i have to leave moreover which topics i should leave as per my official syllabus all these problems will be addressed in the today's video so listen carefully till the end okay first of all the official syllabus is uploaded by iit roorkee 2024 official syllabus and then comes uh, my course are of two type first is hindi course and other is english course you will get it on shrenik jain study simplified app now what's the difference between the two course english course is nothing but speaking and teaching and slides everything are in english but इन हिंदी स्लाइड्स आर इन इंग्लिश पर मैं बातें करूंगा हिंदी में जैसे अभी आपसे बातें कर रहा हूँ वैसे हिंदी में बातें करूंगा और सिखाऊंगा वैसे ही जैसे अंग्रेजी में हम फॉर्मूलाज इक्वेशंस और सारी चीज़ें लिखते हैं राइट सो आई होप दिस पार्ट इज़ वेरी क्लियर ओनली दी स्पीकिंग स्टाइल डिफरेंस यू विल गेट अदरवाइज दी कॉन्टेंट इज सेम नाउ टॉकिंग अबाउट हाउ मेनी चैप्टर्स यू हैव कम्प्लीटेड इन दिस कोर्स सो इट्स अ फुल कोर्स एट चैप्टर्स यू विल गेट विच इज़ कॉमन टू ऑल ब्रांच लीनर अल्जिब्रा कैलकुलस प्रोबिलिटी डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन वेक्टर कैलकुलस कॉम्प्लेक्स वेरिएबल न्यूमेरिकल मेथड एंड ट्रांसफॉर्म थियरी बट वेट अ सेकेंड यू डो नॉट हैव टू स्टडी एवरीथिंग एज पर योर सिलेबस सो विच चैप्टर्स हैव टू स्टडी लेट अस गो वन बाई वन BT Biotechnology Engineering Mathematics section comprises 13 marks so 13% of your gate exam starting with the first chapter <coughs> sorry starting with the first chapter linear algebra matrices determinants system of linear equation eigen values and eigen vectors in short complete folder you have to study all the 10 lectures now you may argue but sir uh, this inverse of matrix was not present operation on matrices was not present rank of matrix was not present these are indirectly used in this topics indirectly used therefore you have to study them understood so i will guide you do not worry when i say the complete folder means the complete folder there is indirect application of the concepts so you can't skip any lecture coming to the calculus now in calculus there is a star because you do not have to study everything but wait a second let us read the syllabus in calculus what we have limits continuity differentiability partial derivative maxima minima sequence and series test for convergence so sequence series and everything it's covered in the aptitude course so do not worry about this talking about uh, this limit continuity differentiability partial derivative maxima minima what about them because when i see this course of yours there are lots of lecture and we do not have all these things integration we do not have then taylor series mvt we do not have please wait a second here when you say that limits continuity differentiability then taylor series must be studied because taylor series is a trick to solve in uh, limits taylor series is a trick to solve limit question therefore you have to study taylor series there is no choice yes mean value theorem you can omit because it's not there in your official syllabus so mean value theorem you can omit what about normal derivative you have to study because uh, normal derivative is needed to solve maxima minima questions and integration we can skip no 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 integration is needed in this poisson normal binomial distribution random variable question solving because it is needed single double triple integration therefore you have to study them you have no choice understood so basically everything you have to study except the mvt topic i hope this part is very much clear coming to the next uh, chapter what is the next chapter that we have in the list uh, the next chapter is probability okay i guess there is some internet issue which is going on hmm there is internet issue which is going on let me choose this because content is same okay probability in probability i have taught basics of probability random variable probability distribution statistics and then we have much more topics what are the topics correlation regression sampling distribution and hypothesis testing right so this much of topics i have explained but you do not have to study everything why because as per your syllabus probability and statistics mean median mode standard deviation is nothing but statistics that you have to study random variables you have to study probability distributions you have to study correlation regression you have to study so what i should not study you might be thinking 
oh this means basics of probability is not there we should not study that and uh, we do not have this uh, 14 and 15 class so we should not study that please make a note 14 15 lectures you can avoid but basics of probability 1 to 3 you cannot avoid because this is needed in aptitude also this is needed in random variable also so you cannot avoid this i hope this much is very clear that basics of probability is needed to solve random variable and also the aptitude question what you can avoid is only the hypothesis classes which is 14 and 15 lecture understood so in probability also you do not have to study everything you can skip that and now coming to the next chapter differential equation so in differential equation also you do not have to study everything because in differential equation what you do not have is the partial differential equation that part you can skip which means when you open the lecture then partial derivative is the 6 and 7 okay you can skip that but 1 2 3 4 5 you have to study everything that you cannot skip clear what will happen in the differential equation you can skip the partial differential equation now you might be thinking what about this laplace transform this laplace transform i have not taught in the differential equation because it's the part of transform theory so transform theory is there here folder is present here transform theory click on the lecture laplace transform 1 2 3 4 you have to study you can skip this 5 6 7 because this is fourier series and fourier series is not there in your syllabus I hope you are getting each and every point Fourier series not there in your syllabus so in transform theory you can skip this topics you can skip this lectures okay and in differential equation you skip partial differential equation in probability you skip the hypothesis in calculus you skip the mean value theorem understood so up till now this much chapters are clear and this was our fifth chapter transform theory coming to the sixth chapter numerical method everything you have to study you cannot skip anything so whatever is there in the folder everything you have to study now this seventh and eighth chapter you can completely avoid complex variables and vector calculus it's not present in your official syllabus so you can skip them there is no need to study which folders vector calculus and a complex variable you should not touch you should not open that okay other folders you have to open and in other folders what to skip is explained here and i hope now you got the clarity about your syllabus thank you for watching this class